A community garden located in the heart of central Phoenix was vandalized over the weekend. Phoenix police are investigating after at least one person, possibly more, stormed into the garden, stealing and damaging plants and property. But some kind hearted volunteers have responded to help Agave Farms bounce back. A place of peace. It took the head of the statue and threw it over there. Devastated by destruction. Shock. I was in complete shock. I honestly couldn't believe it. I'm Leslie Blanchard, God, farm manager at Agave so Farms Community that. Garden, describes the damage caused by vandals on both Friday and Saturday nights. The first morning was more of just a mess and uh, a couple of greenhouses were broken into. Pots were knocked over, plants were ripped apart, but it was all repairable. The second night, however, was more devastating. That second night, a delivery van took the brunt of the attacks, inside and out, complete with a broken windshield. And then as you can see, our statue's been knocked down. And it's custom made of stone, so it's extremely heavy. We're going to have to probably use a bobcat to get that. This 17-acre farm on Central Avenue, across from Steel Indian School Park, has provided gardening classes, yoga, and a weekly food drive helping those hit hard by the pandemic. So we're constantly just... Giving, giving, giving. Um, everything here is ran mostly by volunteers. We have a very limited short staff. This volunteer cleanup was led by Michelle Cloud from Southwest Behavioral and Health Services. Her nonprofit helps local adults bounce back from behavioral issues through volunteering. And it was very therapeutic. I mean, the way that they were when they came back was just, they're almost like a cloud nine. They helped clean up the garbage and all the mess and all the glass. So they are more than willing to help every time and they come with a smile. As for Leslie and the future of the garden. We were devastated, but every day is becoming easier. And Phoenix police say they are continuing their investigation, working to catch those responsible.